Dan Kimberly, Graphics Director for KDM POP Solutions Group. We recently purchased our third HS100 Pro uh, about two months ago. When we were researching and looking at all these different presses, uh, we looked at a variety of different things. We looked at uh, color gamut, we looked at ink deposit, we looked at adhesion, we looked at uh, obviously uh, productivity, image quality. For the most part, we wanted it all. You know, we, we wanted we wanted this thing to be fast, we want the image quality to be great, we want the heads to last forever, we want to do rolls, we want to do sheets, we want to do plastics, we want to do everything on it. Um, that's where that's where the EFI ViewTech HS100 offered all of that. Now, there's there's many things that impressed us about the, the HS100, and I was very surprised though with with the, the v, HS100 was that it had the the best color gamut and and at the same time it had the uh, the lowest ink deposit of the, the ones I tested, which I thought was quite a surprise. The expanded inks that they use on the HS100 are they do a great job. Previously, there was Pantone colors that, that we do, weren't able to hit. It was just uh, it was too far out, out outside of the uh, the gamut. Now with uh, the expanded inks, I can I, we can do a profile and we can take that down to where we're we have a good quality image. Yet we can go outside of that uh, that color range and, and really hit some of those difficult Pantone colors. The pin and cure system has been nice. Uh, how it freezes the dot instantly with the adjustments that you can make. You, we can affect the, the gloss level and set that's helped uh, with one, one account in particular. Over the last few months they, they were kind of drifting to a competitor of ours that had, I'll, I'll say a lesser press. It was, uh, the adhesion wasn't good but it was nice and glossy and it looked, and it looked great. So we got the HS100 and that was something that was a big factor in, in getting in, uh, in winning that client back, so to speak, was now now we could do the the glossy uh, the glossy look like they want, and we have good good ink adhesion. There's some work that we weren't able to get before because uh, it, it involved white, and maybe we could do uh, some white printing uh, in in our uh, our Atlanta location. But if it was any large quantities, then, then we weren't competitive unless we went over to screen print. Um, so now, now that we have with the with the white heads on this thing, we're able to do some some fairly large production jobs with white. The press operators actually love this press uh, in, in comparison to some of the ones that they've run before. It's 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 very user friendly. Uh, they were able to they're able to get up to speed fairly fast. We've been very happy with the presses that we purchased. Uh, at this point, now we have three. The impact of the business by having three of the. Mutech HS100s has been phenomenal. Uh, there's been quite a shift of work going from screen print and offset over to digital, uh, and I only expect that to continue.